Nailed it, former EastEnders star Brooke Kinsella marries best friend Simon Bordley in Magical Christmas Wedding. Former EastEnders star and anti-knife crime campaigner Brooke Kinsella has married her best friend Simon Bordley in a fairy tale Christmas ceremony. Brooke, 34, wed her loyal fiancé on Thursday after being set up on a blind date by Simon's best friend, Judge Robert Render. Brooke posted a photo on Instagram of the pair walking down the aisle after being pronounced husband and wife, with the caption, nailed it alongside a tick symbol. Her related expression told a thousand words as she wed the love of her life, five months after announcing their engagement in July 2017. The former actress now talent manager looked beautiful in a lace fishtail gown and clutching a red bouquet. Brooke's manager Jonathan Shallett posted a picture of beautiful Brooke on Twitter following the ceremony. He wrote, today at Brooke and Salo officially most beautiful lady in the world. Many many congratulations to you and Simon Bordley. Jonathan later revealed to Mail Online that the happy couple fell in love after a blind date set up by Robert Rinder. He confessed, Judge Rinder set Brooke up on a blind date with his best friend Simon and they fell in love. The wedding was also attended by loose women's Linda Robson, whose son Louis was with Ben at the time of the murder and desperately tried to save him. She posted a number of sweet videos of Brooke on her wedding day. To view this video please enable JavaScript, and consider upgrading to a web browser that supports HTML5 video Brooke who played Kelly Taylor in EastEnders from 2001 to 2004 alongside Michelle Ryan as Zoe Slater paid tribute to her late brother Ben Kinsella before her wedding day. The 16-year-old schoolboy was stabbed to death in 2008 in an unprovoked attack in North London. Alongside a sunny snap of the gardens at her wedding location, Brooke wrote, There was never any doubt my little angel would bring the sun out for me today alongside a love art emoji. In December 2011, Brooke was awarded an MBE by Prince Charles for her services to knife crime prevention. After receiving the award at Buckingham Palace, Brooke admitted the day was bittersweet as she wouldn't be there without the death of her brother. More, EastEnders she said, today is so bittersweet for me and my family. This is all Ben, it's not me. I wouldn't be here without him. Got a story? If you've got a story, video or pictures get in touch with the metro.co.uk entertainment team by emailing us celebtips at metro.co.uk. Calling 02036152145 or by visiting our Submit Stuff page, we'd love to hear from you.